During lockdown, thousands of cross-border and seasonal workers were either blocked at internal borders or faced new challenges on their way to work. Police checks, new travel documents and changing rules were the daily routine. I lived in Strasbourg and I had to go to Kiel 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 and I had to go to Kiel. Other mobile workers have been disproportionately affected by measures introduced to contain and prevent the spread of the virus in different EU countries. The European Parliament is committed to protecting frontier workers from such treatment and obstacles in the future. MEPs also want to improve their work conditions beyond the context of COVID-19. Seasonal, cross-border, frontier workers are actually, in a way, the essence of the European Union. They are the living embodiment of the fundamental freedoms of our union. Seasonal workers are essential for our agriculture and food supply chains, regularly crossing borders to harvest produce. Mobile workers also support sectors like healthcare, construction, tourism and many more. Parliament is calling for measures to reduce the social and legal loopholes threatening cross-border workers' safety, increase labour inspections and ensure proper social security coordination. MEPs are calling for a return to free movement for these workers, while ensuring they have sufficient protective equipment and decent accommodation where social distancing measures can be maintained. They should have access to information on risks and their rights in a language they can understand. Parliament is asking the Commission and Member States to enforce existing worker protection laws. We are calling for action about anything. I mean, the solutions are there. What we do for all citizens and workers, we have to do for cross-border and seasonal workers. In the event of possible future waves of COVID-19, members want the EU to be better prepared and safeguard cross-border and seasonal workers' rights.